Right, question 10. So the formulae book tells me this. All I'm doing is I'm just copying from the formulae book. And if I'm looking at a particular value, obviously we've got S6 it prefers to. Um, then it's 1 minus R n over 1 minus R. Right, okay. Right. How is this going to help us? So I'm just going to rewrite what we've got just here. So let's replace this. So here we go. And then I've got 8 over 7 multiplied by S6. So let's just put a 6 here. So that gives me A, 1 minus R to the 6, 1 minus R. Right, OK. They're both dividing by 1 minus R, so we can multiply effectively. Um, so we can just get rid of those. All right. So that gives me A equals 8 over 7A, 1 minus R to the 6. Divide both sides by A. So here we go, we're nearly there now. 1 minus r to the 6. So let's bring this this one over onto this side. So we've got 7 eighths equals 1 minus r to the 6. Add r, score, uh, r to the power of 6 to both sides. Oops. And take away the 7 over 8. So that gives me r to the 6 equals 1 over 8. Right, how on earth do I do this? Um, oh, if we cube root, so what's the, the cube root of r to the 6 is r squared. The cube root of this, right, the clue was the 8, just that. And then if I square root both sides, I'm going to get plus minus just there. So if we look at the question, all right, look, we've got it in the form that we want just there. So k is equal to 2. 